welcome back everybody to No Creek Farms. Woohoo! Here on Farm Simulator 17 with your host, Mr. Blue, uh, aka Tommy Miller. Yes, folks, I am up here in the office. Got the truck and trailer up here, fixing to sell them. I was waiting on this dude to get back, but he told me to just come in and make myself at home, so I was going to. Check out this. We're up here in like way up in Missouri, uh, Wisconsin, or somewhere up in here, you know. And his tags from Florida. Whoa. Cool. But check this out. I, I like this the most. He, he got the right tag on the front. Woohoo! John Deere. Nothing runs like a deer, baby. Yeah, except it's on the wrong wrong truck and usually a Chevrolet. Uh, right out this window here, we got the dryer going. You can see right there, it's steam coming off of them. Uh, I don't know what they're going to do here. Uh, it looks like this room here could be a bathroom. Only a small one. I open this door up right here, and you can go. I'm a, come on, I can do it. Jumpy, jumpy, come on. Oh, that, oh there we go. I was going to say, I was just up here. There we go. I, I would love this if it had a window out right here or something. Well, not that way. Maybe that way. But look here. We can jump down off of there. I'm about to shut these doors back. You might think I'm being nosy. And I'm going to shut this in here. I'm going to go ahead and talk to you. Come on. There we go. I opened the other one. Oops. Anyway, folks, we are going to sell this. Uh, wait, wait. Before I do that, let me do this. That way y'all can see all my goodies up there. All right. Um, oh, yeah, I got back up. Uh, eighteen thousand eight hundred fifty dollars. This holds twenty-one thousand liters, folks. Okay. Um, it's like 25000 for it that we can go buy it. I'll show you that here in a minute. We'll go ahead and sell it. And uh, we're going to jump in into our tippers here. Let me turn that radio down. And we'll go over here and see it's 25000 And this is the one we had for 21,000 liters. 25000 for twenty one. Well, you go over here, it's 20,500 for 25,000 liters. So I'm thinking, hmm, what color should I get? Since we got John Deere, or one mostly have John Deere time we're done, I'm going to go with the green ones. I only got enough money to buy one right now. Which that's okay, because we're getting 4,000 extra liters with this buggy. And of course, you know that leads me down to eight thousand. Oh God, that hurt. That hurt. Oh, we got another truck, so I don't need this truck no more. I uh, wish I ran the fuel out of it, but anyway, pull it over here. We're going to sell it. Uh, I guess I better shut it out first. Don't want it running away. Forty-one thousand eight hundred seventy-five. We're gonna sell this bad boy, okay? That gives me fifty thousand. Um, I'm wanting to buy a auger wagon, but um, I don't want to keep. I want to get this in here. It's a small one. Once it holds sixty thousand, but we're also going to end up getting these two things here. It's the bagger system. And we're going to need that, folks. I'll explain that stuff later. But you will be seeing that in the next couple episodes. And probably this green cart here. We'll have this in here. And we'll have this one right here. And probably this one. I'm not for sure. But we're going to start out with fatten. But right now, folks, I'm in a pickle. I am really in a pickle. I need a planter. 
Oh, Mr. B, you just bought two planes. You bought a brand new plane on the last episode. Well, yeah, well, yeah. Let me show you that planner. It's right here. It shows it does all this, folks. But it only does beans, corn, sugar beets, and sunflowers. That's all it does. Um, so, yeah. Uh, as you can see, these, they do the same thing. And mostly all these over here. That does everything that I need. But it, it's big, folks. It's the biggest planter we got. I don't have a tractor to pull it. Uh, I don't see how many horsepower either. Um, but yeah, all these others. Now these two right here. I need that right there, but I can't afford it right now. So, uh, 18000 I can lease it. So I'm, I'm thinking about going ahead and leasing it because I really need that planter to start planting canola. Um, we got this in here. And that's pretty much it. That is what I want, but uh, it's still 142. We can lease it for 12. Uh, 280 horsepower. I think we're going to go with this one. We're going to lease that. One. Okay. And we just. Look, like we're just going to need some seeds for it. So. Uh, oh, I always do that. Let's go on over here. I just hope these will work. Because I already got some fertilized bags. Uh, let's see, we got cow food, pig food, manure, grass, fertilize, and seeds. So let's go with seeds. I don't know how much that is going to hold. So I'm going to buy four for now. Okay. Now, let's see here. Is there anything else was I need? I need to go to placeables. Heat and plant at 68,000. Wow. Can I lease it? Oh, no, I can't lease it. Okay, well. What we're going to do is cut down some trees. I guess I can't do that. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to walk home. Bam, I'm here. Alright, I'm going to detach. Well, first I'm going to show you. I'll say soybeans, corn, sugar beets, sunflowers, soybeans. So I can't use this one right now. Start the stretcher up and going back here. This in here is the same way. So I'm going to have planters covered for. Uh, Planting soybeans and corn, but I know I didn't need this one wagon right now, but oh lordy, it's doing it again. What is that? Y'all see that? Bunch of white stuff. Oh no, ain't no telling. It's a pretty good sized planter right here. Oh yeah, I forgot this one does it all, don't it? Really? Let's see, that should be canola right there. Uh, 
Oh, I thought that was a tongue on the back, but that's the steps. They're back over here. I think we're probably going to hold about three of these. You can see over there is our uh, new truck we got and trailer to put haul stuff on. Alright, there we go. Oh, that's filling. There we go. See, got some fertilizer and stuff there. And down here, we'll plow on this is fill um, three and four that we're fixing to do. I'll get back to that here in just a minute. Uh, yeah, we got to fill that guy up right there. But. We're going to plant canola and one and two. Three and four is probably going to be corn. And then we're going to do seven, eight, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, if we can get to them, and soybeans. My full. Yeah, that's 100%. So we got two to put on that. Okay. I got to find a way out of here. Uh. Let's go out this way. Probably going to make a road around here. Need to anyway. Be a little bit bigger and better getting in and out. Whoa, 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 whoa. I forgot about the big hole there. Alright now, folks, all this up here is ready to plant. Too big, it's big planter, but I was gonna go work. And I did find out that this is multi terrain, so that means hard workers want to go in either direction they want. And I am running over our grass. Yeah, you know, I think crops of destruction stuff is on. Alright, turn this on. We are planting canola, canola. cross there and now I think I'm going to try our GPS now a lot of time folks uh, oh lordy 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 let's see do this see I'm not angled right Right, right there. I'm just going to hit new. Let's see, that is right. Yeah. Check that off. Um, kind of see where my. I'll overlap this a little bit. And that should do it. Uh, let's see here. Turn that on. And I guess we're ready to go. All right, folks. Uh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I got I got to hang on a little bit here. All right, I'm letting that down. Turning that on. Now I'm letting a wearage marker out. Show y'all what it does. It just makes a mark right there. 
and you keep front of that tractor on that line right there, and you'll be doing all right. Let's see, it looks like everything doing all right. Yeah, I like that. What y'all think about that, folks? A little bit different, ain't it? We might go ahead and keep this planter. I know we're going to have to, uh, Yeah, got a little tire right there. Pretty nice system set up. Now what I'm going to do is get down here. Make a pass across the end. And I'll probably hire a worker. When I come back through. <coughs> Dusty. Cause we got a bunch more work to do, folks, besides this. Whoa, wait, what? There, oh, okay. It's still making. Raise the planter up. Oh, this brings back memories, folks. This brings back memories. I know we don't use ridge markers with GPS, but I just wanted to do that to show y'all. Show y'all what it's like if you had to do it without it. You can turn slightly with these, but you can't turn too sharp. All right. A turn about like this right here wouldn't hurt too bad. here and I'll pick up turn around uh oh th this valley right here at least this thing flex at least now we know it flexes this tractor here just ain't that power to pull this thing I'm wide open right now folks wide open might have to get the 8R put on there I'd turn it off just to give it the power. Let's see what a hired worker is going to do with this thing. GPS on. Oh, look at that spinner. Line her down. And hire a worker. Oh, oh. Don't want that. Off. Okay. Uh, that way we can get all our stuff back on. Alright, we'll go forward a little bit here. Hire a worker. And as you can see, He's just following that mark right there. And, and we get, yeah. Alright, folks, we're going to have to trust him for a little bit, hopefully. Alright, we're going to take this down to our guy over there. We'll come back and get those seeds later. Oh, can I make it? Can I make it? Ooh, barely made it. Barely made it. I know this is a Ford, not a Chevy, but 
We have to do what we got to do, right, folks? Oh, 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 pull that black smoke out. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. Oh, forgot this thing is low. Got to see that area. The crop description is on, folks. Oh, Lordy, he's down here. There we go. Want to block the road and fill him up. What is our planter doing? Can't see right now. Figures. All right. Shut that bad boy off. Oh yeah, I love this truck. All right, we're gonna unstrap. Get in here. Oh yeah. All right, back to our planter. I need to go ahead and do our plow because I can get him going pretty good. I just want to see how this guy's going to turn around. What the world? I think he's going to do pretty good. If not, we're going to just come back to him. Got to get this guy going. I already went down across both ends of three and four here. And it's going to be a little rough, but I think we can get it done. Uh, we're going to have probably to work late doing the tillage, which I just messed up on this. Oh my. Oh well. I'm going to go ahead and plow. I was supposed to fertilize it first. Supposed to fertilize it first, and I forgot. So I'm going to go ahead and plow it, then fertilize it, then cultivate it and fertilize it, and then probably have to fertilize it again after. Oh Lord, oh Lord, I can't, I can't make that turn. I can't make that turn. Let's just do this. Back up this way. Got a fence right there. We got to watch. All right. GPS. Let this bad boy down. And that should do it. We're going to hire a worker. It did not ask for, for the field detention, so maybe it'll work. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's just do this. And this bad boy does not know how to handle this thing, so. Alright, there we go. Oh, uh, we got the scratcher up there. No, we're going further. I think halfway on that. And no, let's see what that's doing. That. Oh, he is working out good down here. Oh yeah. Okay, we are full. I don't know why the tractor didn't say running. Yeah, I'm gonna try to. Hopefully, we can have grass here. We can mow, make some bales and stuff, and we'll try to get some cows going. And yes, folks, I use GPS on everything, especially on this. All right, let's get to spraying a little bit. We are almost out of time. Wow, time flies when you're having fun. But what I do on this, I fertilize one and two here. 
which one's over there and here's two this funny shape uh oh I missed some go down this way a little bit uh, let's see uh, that should do it yeah I want to have front weight on this I might one more through after this and I think I can hire a worker to get it done We can have go check on our planner. So I'm gonna hire a worker there. Just making sure he didn't look like he skipped a little bit right here. Oops, sorry. Yeah, you way. Yeah, he skipped a tiny bit right there. That'll be alright though. We can come back and get that. And that don't matter. Oh, 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 I like to flex wings. Okay, we're keeping this. We're keeping this player. I like to flex wings there, folks. All right. Ike and three is going back up. We got down to the bottom real quick. Alright, this guy will be alright for a minute. Hey, he went all the way down. Caught the fertilized rig just in time. Okay. That look like it's going to work out pretty good, folks. I'm going to back up. Get him started. And he should be able to finish the rest of this field on his own. And done a good job here, buddy. Done a good job. Just got to finish this patch right here up. Now I think we'll have this a canola, and that'll be just an extra selling crop. And if we can't sell it when we need to, we might put in one of those bags. Let's see how that goes. I think that'd be pretty neat. And we might end up doing that with the uh, soybeans too. I thought that cover was open. My bad. But alright folks, we are almost out of time. So, what I'm fixing to do is finish up this canola. Right over here and uh, fill two. And it would be offset a little bit. Be yeah, alright though. I think I'm gonna do this by hand. Cause it all curves. cricket there all 
Where'd your marker went in the ground? Yeah, I love that flex wings there. It really helps a lot. And one thing about this, the AI worker would be alright, but I don't know if it, I know it would do it on the combines. They work pretty good, but Yeah, it looks like he's Ike is blocked by an object. Okay. We're gonna have to go check it out. Alright, I'm gonna let him sit right here for a minute. Oh lordy, okay. Alright folks, well I'm gonna finish up this plowing and stuff and yeah, a tree got me or something. Fence line or something there. But I'm probably going to have to borrow some money here pretty soon. Wish he went on down, but I know why he turned around because he could. But probably going to have to borrow some money because I need to get some other things. Um, so, yeah. But I'm going to finish planting canola, get all field one and two done. We're going to move up here on these fields next episode and uh, see what we can do. Maybe it'll be the next day by then. Who knows? That's one thing about this is I got to do what I can do and the time I do it. So it might be a couple episodes where it's still all one day. But anyway, folks, I just want to say a big thank you to all of you. And if you don't mind, please hit that subscribe button if you're new. If you like what you see, because a bunch more of it's coming, folks. And also, don't forget to hit that like button on your way out. And you're watching Mr. Blue Farms, a.k.a. Tommy Miller. And folks, we will see y'all next time. Here on Farming Simulator 7. Later, folks. Bye.